Hi, my name's Mark Bowden from Car and Higo, and today we're going to take a look at our virtual placement system and take a behind the scenes tour as to how it's used in conjunction with real time player tracking data. The first principle was that it had to be on a single server. So it had to be a small footprint, it had to seamlessly integrate into any of the trucks. The second is it had to be operated by an EVS operator, so no specialist tools were required, it had to be easy to use. And the third is that it had to be fast enough that we could have an analysed replay within the first set of replays straight after an incident. The first thing we have to do is calibrate the cameras. We require particular shots on three pre-designated cameras. We work with the cameraman to acquire these shots um, and without any instrumentation on the cameras or any, any instrumentation on lenses, we're able to track the, the pitch including lens distortion parameters and the curvature of the field. The process generally takes about 45 minutes if you're doing three cameras. Uh, and once the cameras are in and set, that will see you through the entire game. The system's built to work on various sports like soccer, tennis, rugby, and NFL. Once the cameras are calibrated, the operator will need to check the chroma key and make sure the data is flowing from the player tracking system. In this example, we're using our own system, TrackAb, which is deployed across the Premier League and various other leagues throughout Europe. But virtual placement is agnostic to the data it can receive and will work with most tracking systems in the marketplace today. The player tracking operators will tag all the players to make sure that they're correctly identified. And then once the game is kicked off, you're able to then tag any player in real time or in replay. And all the maintenance tasks during the game, such as chroma key and corrections, um, they can all be done on the fly as well. It's a two color chroma key, so it can handle uh, light and shade and inclement weather conditions. One of the things that was important to us was that everything we can offer was editorially relevant and it can also be driven by the commentators. Ego on Willian and Ramirez. Willian Ramirez, Ego, yeah. I, I think I can tell it. Just see coming into your picture now, Ramirez, slight surprise from Jose Mourinho. I think he formed this uh, partnership last year with William Moore Central. Regularly, the commentator will have a direct line of communication and will make requests on the fly as something that's relevant there and then. So that can either be in the live game or in replay. And the handling of the data is exactly the same within replay as it is within live. One of the advantages of working with us is that we've had the experience from doing over 150 games like this. So the system's been built and refined to a point where it's now ready to go. I think the biggest thing for us is that we've actually built a system we're quite proud of. It was the first of its kind and it has now completely delivered on what we'd set out to, to achieve. Virtual placement's already in use across Europe every weekend. It's been on air hundreds of times already over the last 18 months, but we're really looking forward to about where we can take it and what we can do with it next. 